From around the world, many people travel to Australia in search of a dream. They leave their families, their friends, a familiar culture and a land they know well for the opportunity to achieve great things in a land down under. From north, south, east and west, you, the students of Kent Institute Australia, arrived here in Sydney and Melbourne to follow your dreams through study. And now, after all the hard work, ups and downs, the joys, the challenges, the achievements, the discovery and experiences along the way, you have reached the end of your studies. You have probably faced bigger challenges than any of you could have imagined, but you persevered and are here now having achieved your goal and graduating. You have made new friends, enjoyed new adventures and learned so much about so many things. This is your graduation, a celebration of everything you have given and all you have gained to get to where you are now. Kent students of 2020, this is your time to remember your journey and celebrate this special and momentous occasion with family and friends and with those who shared the journey with you. Congratulations. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sławka Tymosiewicz, International Recruitment Executive of Kent Institute Australia. I am your Master of Ceremonies for today's graduation. I ask you to join in singing the first verse of the Australian National Anthem. We are thrilled today to have the National Anthem sung by Mr. Dimitri Kopanakis, a long time friend of Kent. Ceremony for Kent Institute Australia. Today, students will be graduating from both our higher education and vocational courses. At Kent Institute Australia, our graduation ceremonies are all about the celebration of achievements. Under the challenging circumstances you have all faced in 2020, this achievement is particularly worth celebrating. I now invite Emeritus Professor Ken Hawkins, acting today in the capacity of chair of Ken's governing board to deliver the welcoming address. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and graduands. Uh, also to uh, embassy and consular officials, our governing board directors, academic board chair and external academic board members, Kent agents, parents and family, friends, and all those viewing this ceremony online from places as far away as uh, Brazil in South America, Indonesia, the Philippines, Vietnam, India, Nepal, Sri Lanka, the United Kingdom even, the USA, Canada, a truly global event. Welcome to you all. I would like to ask the graduands here today a question or two. Do you remember the journey 
that changed your life and brought you to Australia, the start of the journey that led you to Kent Institute Australia. First, there was a family decision. Will we or won't we send our son or daughter overseas? Then your own decision to which university of college will I attend? Which country? Which degree? A TAFE, vocational education, higher education, IT, accounting or business. Then completing the application, maybe going to an agent for assistance and support with a visa application, and then receiving that special letter of offer from Kent Institute Australia. But it didn't end there. Then there were travel bookings, accommodation to organise, orientation to a new country, language, culture, orientation to the college, studying, lectures, assignments, exams, new friends, hours in the library, or maybe, and hours in the laboratories, definitely. Do you remember the journey that changed you and resulted in you being here with us today? Where you now sit and are what is titled as graduands, which means a person about to receive their degree. Soon we will, you'll be called by the Chair of Academic Board. Now, it would have been across the stage, but today it's across the Zoom screen. And receive your testimony for your degree. If we were face to face on the stage, I would then be moving your tassel from right to left. And then you would have passed your rite of passage and become a graduate. Today, as you become a graduate, albeit virtually online, it will mean you have your first degree and in many cases, you may well be the first member of your family to do so. So after all the hard work, you will become a graduate. Then you will become an alumni, meaning that you will be part of Kent's family going on forever. You'll be an alumni of Kent Institute Australia, a former student of the college or university, so that you have a lot of responsibility in representing the organisation from which you achieved your qualification. So you will need to set a positive example so that Kent can look professional in, through its uh, graduates and the success they will have. We'll take a lot of pride in saying, this student studied with us at Kent. And we'd like to keep in touch with you. In fact, we have a lot of alumni, one of whom is going to be your guest speaker today. And we would like you to tell us about the continuing journey in your life, in your profession, and maybe in future studies. So today, this part of the journey will end. But as the other guests will tell you, that's just the big journey, that is just the journey to being a graduate. It starts again if you pursue a postgraduate degree, pursuing a professional career, but forever learning based on the foundation you've received from Kent Institute Australia. Please stay in contact with us. It's now my pleasure to introduce to you our guest speaker. I'm going to invite Sang Nguyen to speak with you. Sang graduated from Kent's Bachelor of Business in 2014 and as a marketing support and business administration enthusiast, she has gained broad experience across a range of industries, including consumer service, technology and healthcare. Sang's career passion involves fostering continuous improvement and professional development. She is currently employed as a business assistant at Australian Unity Home Care Service and recently completed a certificate in aged care from the University of South Australia, an example of continuing learning. In 2014, Sang joined the Kent Course Advisory Committee, which is now titled the Industry Advisory Committee, as the graduate student representative. In this role, and as a Kent alumni, her contributions have been invaluable in the continuous improvement of Kent 
industry engagement activities. It's a great honour to have introduced Sang to deliver her speech to you today. Class of 2020, today is your special day and I am honoured to be celebrating your achievements with you. It is your time, your voice and your perseverance that will redefine the new normal. We might have to work with uncertainties and even adjust to changes in lightning speed, but never let fear get in between you and your goals. This crisis might be the inspiration for some to move into a new field. So try that, nothing can hold you back. We are living in a world where everything is interconnected. So your interests and skill today will evolve through time. Take what you've learned at Kent Institute Australia and what you will learn on the job. Apply this knowledge and shift your thinking towards solutions. Utilize that future value of money for your savings. Build your personal brand through integrated marketing knowledge. Or showcase your logistic problem solving skills. Try new ideas. Fail, repeat until you succeed. And in that process of growth, practice mindfulness. Think of your communities and everyone who is at the front line. Think of your families. Your contribution to create a better society is what makes each of you a hero of the future. The path of success will require your persistence. I will once again graduate in the place that you are now, and I completely understand how you feel. There is as much excitement as there are an answer question on your career path. You might be rejected one day. You might not know the reason. You might think that time has gone by with no meaning. Breathe. Go for a walk at least 30 minutes a day. Then get back into this ongoing life cycle and give yourself a pat on the back and say, I am what I want to become. More important than anything is what you perceive from yourself. Success is what you will achieve by overcoming all these challenges. Congratulations, class of 2020. Thank you, Sang. I now call upon the chair of academic board, Professor Lee Wood, to present the graduates. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Professor Hawkins, I certify to you that the vocational education and training and higher education graduates presented before you today have fulfilled the requirements prescribed by Kent Institute Australia. I ask that you present them with their respective awards. In the name of the governing board and by my authority as executive director, I am pleased to present the newest graduates with their awards. Emeritus Professor Hawkins, I now call upon Mr. Rafael Gonshur head of vocational education to present the graduates. Emeritus Professor Hawkins, I present to you graduates from vocational education and training courses. Certificate four in accounting and bookkeeping. Roy Boonen. A.V. Rose de la Paz. Amandine Paré. Prasanna Radha Krishna. Certificate 4 in business. Lucy Alexandra Massey. Hi, Long Wing. Małgorzata Wisniewska. Certificate 4 in Marketing and Communication. Abigail Michelle Finder. Go Bie Zong Tai. 
Laura Masterson. Catherine Overend. Denise Abigail Paragas. Katie Jane White. Shirley. Certificate 4 in Web-Based Technologies. Albert. Steven Omaitre. Alison Sibel Bell. Olavo Alves Campos Bueno. Lorenzo Capisonda. Melvina Chandra. David Chazarra Brook. Ina Diazambuja Seabra. Chloe Ann Estilo. Tamara Osorio Gallegos. Christian Renz Garcia. Punit Ansula Gunase Kara. Rafael Guzman. Kaori Hatori. Hao Ying Ho. Germano Zanio Hoffman. Konkasum Hola It. Eri Hoshiyama. Junko Hosoya. Thi Kam Sung Nguyen. Shiori Li. Sachiko Kitagawa. Steven Kolostiak. Jarina Maharjan Putri Maria Konstantinos Dukas Yeji Park Jonathan Christian Polycarpio Willow Sienna Talula Postlethwaite Pedro Ovalle Puelma Kento Suzuki Maggie Tantra Carlos Eduardo Hernández Trujillo Alexander Vijaya Diploma of Accounting Sara Colombo Ijima Galay Edita Lipka Chulun Sik Maya Ma. Jonathan Tordesilias. Diploma of Digital Media Technologies. Caio Asiari. Ida Ayu Angadevi. Matias Espinosa Botero. Alexandre Dumas Mendes Bueno. Andres Camargo Camargo. Luciana de Souza Junko Hosoya Langlam Taike Nakano Chayanit Pun Prasa Lucy Zrubova Diploma of Leadership and Management Sara Grams Ombika Karki Rodan Karuna Kal Lech Susmita Lamishani Ariana Gonçalves Guerra Lima Stephanie Claire Ong Maapni Christine Manuro Charmaine Masian Marco Nardi Emily Nigas Lei Wen Jamwing Putu Puspa Sari Lian Arnie Resplandor Grace Joko Mujo Hoi Kwan Chang Daisy Tugai 
Monica Zenisha. Diploma of Marketing and Communication. Arion Tuk Baldando. Ot got set set but chul lon. Jasmine Quaresma Kalaika. Herma Holly Maria Camille. Myla Selina Francesca Corpus. Thomas Evans. Albert. Guazon Hatairat Kawiwat Charanon Jasper John Lim Donalyn Reyes Carlo Luis Ruiz Jacqueline Tabats Anton Dolin Vijaya Lili Laura Wutschka Diploma of Project Management Jamie May Fajardo Mohammad Yasir Farooqi Mohammed Salim Farooqi Hazel Hornashon Hazel Mosquetes Charmaine Samaniego Velina Serafimova Gerard Benedict Silverio Sampan Nataman Isaac Torres Bahar Zuri Diploma of Website Development Janika Riza Barrios Gian Vincent Dunca Joan Garduke Baratit Greenhorn Jose Pedro Arancibia Lorenzini Tenvilu Jerwin Martin Donna Marie Barumog Catherine Jane Tanner Jakub Varinsky Advanced Diploma of Accounting Sara Colombo Edita Lipka Jonathan Tordesilias Advanced Diploma of Information Technology Hamad Al Sediki Marinela Arsovska Rochelle Kalara Edre Chaser Kasahe Ana Carolina Mota Castro Tanut Tangrung Wang Sui Luis Henrique de Oliveira Fernandes Shane Giselle Garcia Ayumi Kichia Langlam Lucas Lira Dourado Jose Pedro Arancibia Lorenzini Tenvilu Victor Mazei Maggi Jerwin Martin Sebastián Herrera Martinez Juana Suana Tomás Ramírez Rendón Sirin Sanson Maite Silva Fioroto Lucy Zrbova Gerald Talampas Advanced Diploma of Leadership and Management Crystal Alcover Claire Ann Beltran Jose Marie Castro Daint Paul Sepilio John Florido Diaz Aliana Genesis Ensenado Zarina Jean Esguera Setsada Latanavong 
Otgonchime Namda Marie Joy Novesteras Princess Diane Joy Resho Randolph Brian Ronquillo Samiksha Sakya Osin Mega Swista Cole Tari Jennifer Yasmin Umar Tiki Maiva Advanced Diploma of Marketing and Communication Bayama Altan Kuya Federica Belosi Nalini Nasunton Kamon Wan Promin Warunkan Yindi Advanced Diploma of Program Management Paula Shush Batalha Boeira Ailey McLaren Gillis Camille Ann Gubatan Michelle Gutierrez Marcelino Librilia Christian Benedict Maliari Lorna Peralta Emeritus Professor Hawkins, this concludes the presentation of graduates from vocational courses. Thank you, Rafa. Ladies and gentlemen, I am delighted to present to you another musical performance by Mr. Dimitri Kopanakis. Thank you, Dimitri. I now call upon Surjal Patel, Executive Dean, to present the graduates from higher education courses. Emeritus Professor Hawkins, I present to you graduates from higher education courses. Bachelor of Accounting. Hani Lu Abba. Manisa Adhikari. Wahozit Singh Arora. Ankit Arora. Rishabh Arora. Neha Arora. Naupreet Singh Ojla. Vikas Bika. Débora Fernanda Santos Barbosa Nisa Bosnet Kushal Bosnet Manis Bandari Pramod Bandari Rupak Bandari Savin Vatrai Tulsi Vatrai Pradeep Husal Nitis Bogati, Stalin Bohora, Ranjot Singh Boparai, Ming Yi Chen, Xin Ying Chia, Kuang Ling Dang, Kritika Dower, Carolini Gemelo Falcusi. Leticia Apa de Oliveira Silva Vanessa Santana Proeseller de Paula Brindiria Dergo Dalai Sajid Desar Sulojana Devkota Elaine Joy Federico Ernilet Jane Gonzalez Suijita Gopali Rita Maya Gora Bandana Gurung Samina Gurung Sonia Gurung Bilal Haider 
फिलोसफिकल इस्लाम समृद्धि जैन दीपिका केसी आस्था कडरिया राजन कणेल कोमल कौर राजदेव कौर किरण बेर कौर पविता खाण जेमा लुईस खुदला बीनू लामा नीलिमा लिंबू जोआन फेलिपे Alves Lopes Arley Giane Ferrares Magalhães Manoj Thapa Magar Simran Kaur Makhar Manoj Mali Sandhya Malla Kisa Manandhar Mandeep Kaur Paras Marwa चिराग मेहता हिमालय नगीला प्रतीक्षा नेपाल सुमन ओली कार्तिक पंड्या अस्मिता पराजुली Thi Mai Lang Pham Thi Hing Fan Juan Sebastian Carreño Pinzon Frizana Poon Amis Puri Marlucia Aparecida Hamil Sammani Ranjit Danish Rasit Sivaregmi पविता रिजाल सीता रुक्का नीरज सरेन मांजा सारी निखिल साही डेविड बिरसाख्य शिवा शर्मा थायो अदले के शोदीप मुस्कान श्रेष्ठ निशी श्रेष्ठ मिशन श्रेष्ठ सिल्विया श्रेष्ठ दीपा श्रेष्ठ इकबाल सिंह सिद्धू गुरजोत सिंह जशनप्रीत सिंह मनिंदर सिंह नवनीत सिंह चाहत सिंह जनप्रीत सिंह सिरिसमान सिंह मनप्रीत सिंह बुइचे जी आकृति थापा विवेक तिमल सिन्हा तातियाना कैरोलिना अंदोनेगी तोबिंग मछिंद्र उप्रेति सागर वर्मा एलिसा दिग्ना विरसवरंडा रेंज मार्टिन विलियेगस पोत्सवान वोंगकमशाओ जालिंग जंग बैचलर ऑफ बिजनेस बैचलर ऑफ बिजनेस स्पेशलाइजेशन इन अकाउंटिंग सुरबे अग्रवाल विनीता भट्टराय अखिल रेड्डी बोयापली वरुण सापागाई मुस्कान छाबरा मेथी डांग कोमल दिलॉन तमारा होत्रिगिस एल मशनी विशेष ग्रेवाल जैकिया इस्लाम जोनसन इवान 
रेशव जोशी नमन कपिला अंजु कार्की रेवंत कार्की रमनदेव कौर सुखवीर कौर अश्नील किशोर रवि कुमार अमित कुमार वे जी लिम सरोज मैनाली हाइसा मेंजस मोरेनो वरुण नागराज नेहा रायसा नेपाल कामना नेउपाने भारत पंडिया अंकित पौडेल पायल विंदा प्रातीवी राहुल शैलेश सापकोटा अर्चित सैगल वर्षा शाही अनिल श्रेष्ठ श्वेता श्रेष्ठ कुर्तेज सिंह कबीर सिंह परमिंदर सिंह प्रभजीत सिंह पापा विनी सोमनाथ सुबोध सुवेदी रमिता तामांग छांची संजय थपलिया खंगचंग खनलंचन थेथु जांगवंग ngọc phương trinh vũ kimberly vijaya sayed mohammad anas jafar bachelor of business specialization information system ranjan acharya anjurom santarina angelas vivian akino susmita budathoki नितिन शम स्टेफनी जोलिवेरा संतोष क्रिसलदा फर्नांडिस सैम्युअल गिल ब्रूनो बारबोसा अनादा अहमद वाहिद मोहम्मद मोहम्मद इस्माइल अनुराज केसी सुमनप्रीत कौर जस्मिन कौर जसप्रीत कौर नाओ खवानो उमर रशीद खान दीपा खत्री संदीप कुमार चिको लंग गुलाम मोहम्मद मुबासिर एबिगेल Pamintuan Yash Sashikant Patel Shital Ashwini Prasad Jasmeet Kamal Sal Munish Sharma Adarsh Sharma Anand Sharma Ayush Shrestha Priya Shrestha करणजोत सिंह मनमित सिंह मनप्रीत सिंह आदेशपाल सिंह आनंद सिंह दमनप्रीत सिंह हरजीत सिंह सुखमनदीप सिंह सैयद डैनियल सोहेल विशाल मोहम्मद 
Zubair, Bachelor of Business, Specialization Management, Davina Agustin, Majid Ali, Diana Apetroy, Rudy Eli Louis Benamo, Yalan Boy, Abednego Junior Kalunsag. Wang Lang Anjung Bitchu Garten Guan Xian Go Tungalag Kongoro Anita Kok Mi Su Li Te Tu Hung Wing Tashami Square Michael Paspanojga Queenie Monique Polycarpio Kunal Singla Tatanun Sripom Victor Sanjaya Sugiato Vishal Verma Vishal Bachelor of Business Specialization in Management and Information Systems Idalino de Jesus Rodriguez Salazar. Jefferson Silverio. Bachelor of Business, Specialization in Management and Marketing. Mayara Belo Queiroz Conceição. Tessarinda Agnisha Joana. Darlene Juan. Bachelor of Business, Specialization in Marketing. Jody Alex. Fernanda Brito Paiva Maria Fernanda Davila Gomes Inesa Alves dos Santos Jovan Evendi Jolie Ann Irinko Mantule Hassan Ali Mir Olivier Niva Carolina Belalcázar Rios. Gurkiran Jit Singh. Bachelor of Business, Specialization in Marketing and Information Systems. Ngọc Anh Thư Mai. Bachelor of Information Technology. Samundra Acharya. Roshan Adhikari. Kosal Adhikari. Swarnim Adhikari Mohammad Asen Temi Tope Kawuyu Angape Kasun Tharaka Hapu Archich Janis Ariel Anup Ondakar Madan Ayer Kuldip Kaur Bath Maria Cristel Seni Baga. Katia Paola Velasquez Bejar. Vikas Bandari. Susmita Bandari. Niranjan Bandari. Kusum Bidari. Nikhil Chabra. Sundar Chetri. Prajol Dahal Sasang Deuza Amandip Kaur Dilan Dinesh Avas Dulal Muktur Garbara Santos Gorathoki Raja Gupta Mohammed Umer Hasim Kasarina Christine Horizon Rifa Jaha Shivalal Jaisi Rohan Jaiswal Anup Kattil Arshad Kaur Harpreet Kaur Chakprit Kaur 
मुस्तफा अली खान पार्थ खनाल नवीन खनाल श्रीजन खरेल एजबेता कोजलोवस्का पूजन छेत्री कमल कुमार मरी क्रिस्टीन लक्वेस्टा सोंजन लामा सजीत मगर रामचंद्र आले मगर नीरज महर्जन सौरभ राज महत्व स्टेफन मैक्सिमोविच सागर मानंदर मार्सेलो मिशेलिनी नवदेव इनोज नेपाने माइकल एंजली ओबोग पूजन पराजुली गौरव फुयाल लुइस पियरी जुसेपे जुलियानो लोपेस पिनेरो कमिल पोखरेल काजल प्रेत सुमन पुरी सुदीप रानावत दीपेश राव कलाल रियाज आंद्रे रफ मणि कुमार रॉय श्रीराम साहा शरणजीत संदो संजय सुदीप सापकोटा प्रवीण सापकोटा सना विराट ने कनान गरेज दिमुत हसन का सनावित रात ने नवीन कुमार साही शरण देव प्रणव शर्मा आयुष शर्मा दीपेश शेरपा गौरव श्रेष्ठ संतोष श्रेष्ठ साहिल सिद्धू हरविंदर सिंह चौधवीर सिंह अमनप्रीत सिंह दिलावर सिंह हरबलप्रीत सिंह सिमरनजीत सिंह अर्षदीप सिंह प्रकाश बहादुर सिंह इंदरपाल सिंह अमलोक सिंह सुबेश स्थापित संतोष सुब्बा समीन सुवेदी रेमन सुवेदी लोकनाथ सुवेदी सिन जिन थान धीरेन्द्र बम ठकुरी बिपिन खाड़ ठकुरी अथलेश थापा सौरभ तिमल सिन्हा मिलन तिम सिन्हा रेंज क्रिश्चियन मलबानन वर्गारा विंडी Emeritus Professor Hawkins this concludes the presentation of graduates from higher education courses Thank you Struja and congratulations to all of our graduates Ladies and gentlemen I am delighted to present to you another musical performance by Mr Dimitri Kopanakis Thank you again Dimitri. I now call upon the chair of academic board, Professor 
Lee Wood to present the Dr. Anthony John Coop Award for Student Leadership. Ladies and gentlemen, I am now pleased to welcome Dr. Anthony John Coop, the inaugural Kent Academic Board Chair, to announce the recipient of the Dr. Anthony John Coop Student Leadership Award. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It's my pleasure to announce the 2020 recipient of the Dr. Anthony John Coop Student Leadership Award. This award recognises students who've demonstrated a combination of the following. A strong commitment to studies, the ability to respond to challenges, a capacity to act as a mentor to other students, a willingness to contribute to the life of the campus, outstanding potential for significant leadership in their future career, clear commitment to the value of cultural diversity, creative talent and enterprise. For outstanding performance throughout her studies, I announce this year's recipient, Mu Chi T. Congratulations, Mu Chi, or Marine, as you are known to your fellow students. The selection panel recommended Ms. T for the 2020 Dr. Anthony John Coop Leadership Award in recognition of the qualities she's demonstrated both in and out of the classroom and the potential shown for success in the future. Academically, she's achieved outstanding results with an average mark of 89% and she's been the recipient of three Dean's List Awards for outstanding academic performance. Miss T has shown consistent engagement in all aspects of student life at Kent, both academic and social. As a previous SRG member, an active mentor, she's also been committed to her fellow students, illustrating an openness and willingness to offer support and guidance. Leading by example in class and at events, she's an excellent role model, well known and respected by both staff and students. Her presence and support at events has been significant, as has her communication in providing feedback and ideas for improvement. She demonstrates natural leadership skills, has the courage to stand up for others and has risen to challenges and fate that she has faced all along the way. These attributes show great potential to be a strong and effective leader. Again, congratulations, Ruchi, on your leadership award and congratulations to all of your fellow graduates for their success. Thank you, Dr. Coop. And um, I have Maureen's award here. And congratulations, Maureen. Um, she's in the room next door to me, so I can give it to her later today. Um, I will now present the Teaching Excellence Awards. Teaching Excellence Awards are a feature of the governing board at Kent. The awards recognise the outstanding qualities of our academic staff. The selection criteria for the awards encompass four key areas, teaching, leadership, scholarly productivity and community engagement. The academics were judged on many aspects of their performance, including how they motivated and inspired students, how they developed the curriculum and the acknowledgement received by students, colleagues and the wider community for their contributions and commitment to education at Kent. So the winner of the Teaching Excellence Award for Vocational Education and Training is Maya Kowalska from Niet. Maya is a dedicated, caring and passionate vocational trainer at Kent Institute Australia. She currently teaches the Diploma of Marketing and Communication. As a trainer and assessor, Maya creates a dynamic learning environment using real life case studies, 
which helps students to correlate practical applications with theory. She enjoys working closely with students, sharing her knowledge and experience, and regularly receives positive feedback from her students. Congratulations, Maya. And Maya's award looks like this. <clears throat> the winner of the Melbourne Teaching Excellence Award for Higher Education is Ashantha Wickramanayaka. Ashanta is an accounting lecturer and unit coordinator based in the Melbourne campus of Kent Institute Australia. Ashanta completed his postgraduate degree in accounting at Charles Sturt University Australia with an Academic Achievement Award and he earned his undergraduate degree in business at the University of Kalayaya in Sri Lanka. His professional development in interests lie in the area of accounting and finance and currently he is associate member of CPA Australia. In addition to being a higher education lecturer, Ashanta has served in banking and finance in Australia and overseas. His professional experience in both teaching and working in finance created additional value to students' learning experience through his time at Kent. Congratulations, Ashanta. Um, this year, the Sydney Teaching Excellence Awards for Higher Education is awarded to two academics. The winner of the first Sydney Teaching Excellence Award for Higher Education is Imran Salahuddin. Imran is an information systems and technology lecturer at the higher education level with extensive teaching and research experience. He has been involved in teaching and academic management roles for more than a decade now. Currently, he's working as course coordinator and higher education lecturer in the Bachelor of Information Technology at Kent Institute Australia. Prior to this, he has been teaching at different universities in Australia and abroad. Imran completed a master's degree in business systems at Monash University and a bachelor's degree in computer science from the University of Pune. His teaching philosophy lies with the meaningful student relationship and application of knowledge through real life experience. He has received several research and conference grants through his research career and has published in academic journals. Congratulations, Imran. The winner of the second Sydney Teaching Excellence Award for Higher Education is Dr. Benoit Varghiz. Benoit is a lecturer and course coordinator for the Bachelor of Information Technology at Kent Institute Australia. And he has just been promoted to Associate Dean Sydney. He has over four years teaching experience in tertiary education and over six years experience in academic research. He completed his PhD in electrical systems, specialising in energy wave content delivery systems at the University of New South Wales in collaboration with Data61 CSIRO Sydney. His areas of interest and expertise are in cybersecurity, content distribution, sustainable computing and the Internet of Things. He has extensive international expertise, uh, working as a guest researcher at the University of Massachusetts, USA and the University of Linköping, Sweden. He believes that hard work and dedication are the cornerstones of success in student life as well as in career. Congratulations, Benoit. Congratulations to all of our academics. Emeritus Professor Hawkins. This concludes the presentation of awards. I now call upon the student respondent to deliver the response on behalf of the graduates. Coincidentally, the recipient of the 2020 Dr. Anthony John Cope Student Leadership Award was also chosen as this year's representative to deliver the response on behalf of the graduates. So please welcome Moi Chu Ti Marin. Respected faculties and staff, distinguished guests, beloved parents, relatives, friends, and fellow graduates.
Good afternoon from Sydney. Um, today, last year, I remember I was planning how we were going to party hard after the graduation ceremony. We were so excited about our graduation trip. But bam, enter 2020. Everything has changed. First, there was the entire bushfire crisis, then this relentless pandemic. No more chit-chatting in class, replaced with a Zoom inbox. Coffee breaks became a lonely trip to the kitchen. And in the midst of all of these chaotic events, I took the time to reflect and be appreciative for those around me and essentially myself. Firstly, thanks mom, thanks dad, thanks all the loved ones and friends for always be there for me and for always lending a shoulder when I need it most. A big thank to all the lecturers for being the light to guide our ways and for enforcing the traffic light rules. Green being good to go, yellow be cautious and red just stop it, fix your similarity right before a resubmission. Also, I got to thank all the administrative staff for reminding us that assignments are not the sole source of our stresses. But most of all, I would like to thank all the supportive staff, especially the ALS for help for protecting us from the wrath of the assignments and the counselor for keeping us that we're safe and wouldn't go off the edge. And group work, uh, it might be a disdain to some of us, but admit it or not, we all have learned just from different perspectives. There were group members that were so blessing. They were as supportive as they possibly be. But meanwhile, there are also group members that taught us the essence of patient and anger management. Regardless, they all contributed to building who we are right now. So say thank you if you are streaming this with your mates. If not, send them a message or give them a call. Lastly, perhaps the one that is often neglected. We should also acknowledge ourselves as well to overcome all sorts of obstacles and put on this regalia is an incredible milestone worth celebrating. We have pushed ourselves to do assignments that we weren't so fond of. We have pushed ourselves to collaborate even when we didn't enjoy group work so much. And we have pushed ourselves to our fullest potential to achieve great success in life. Success per se is not about being the greatest of all, but be, being better than our yesterdays. It's a pat on the shoulder. We made it to 2020, almost 20 days to go. And more importantly, we made it to a bachelor degree. We are equipped with knowledge and skill. We are the class of 2020s. Wait, hold on. How could I forget? Um, shout out to my dearest companion, Coffee, the one that enabled all of those all-nighters morning classes and concentration in general. Our preferences may differ, but our love for caffeine is the same. It is coming to an end, this speech, this ceremony, and this bachelor life, but it's also marked the beginning of our act two, the adventure. Class of 2020, we are the silver lining of the year 2020. We are the one good thing out of all this mess, and we will continue to be the better version of ourselves. Class of 2020, congratulations, we are officially graduated. Thank you. Thank you, Maureen. Emeritus Professor Hawkins will now deliver the charge of graduates. I now ask all graduates, wherever you are across the world, to please stand. I charge you all as graduates of Kent Institute Australia to maintain a commitment to lifelong learning, to strive for truth, integrity and compassion, to contribute to your chosen profession and by the application of your abilities, support and nurture the communities of which you are part. May your rewards bring honour to Kent, your chosen profession and to yourself. Good luck and best wishes. Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes today's graduation ceremony. On behalf of the governing board and Kent staff, I would like to thank you for attending today's ceremony. 
Congratulations.